Have we ever asked ourselves, why do we have pets? What drives us to want them? What benefits could an animal have on our life? Questions like these are something that I hardly ever wonder, but very, very curious indeed. For those who have a pet, they spend every day with them around the house, and for some reason, having them there is just a completely different experience when compared to those who don't have a pet. Is there anything special about pets that we have not realized at all that may be beneficial to us? In this speech, I will explain why pets will make our lives better. Now, what do I mean by making our lives better, you may ask? Well, a pet of any kind can be beneficial by providing that company and support that people may need when feeling lonely and they also enhance a person's mood when they feel depressed. In addition, I will also address why some people don't think a pet can benefit because of the expenses they claim the pet adds. I hope that by the end of this speech, both pet and non-pet owners can realize that our pets do what our pets do for us and appreciate them the way they deserve to be. Now, to have an idea of how pets come into play in reducing loneliness, let us think, what causes a person to feel lonely? Well, according to lifeline.org, loneliness is a feeling of sadness or distrust about being by yourself or feeling disconnected from the world around you. So how do pets help deal with this issue? Well, animals without a doubt are great company to have around when you live alone or just feel isolated. According to Ian H. Stanley and other contributors studying between pet ownership and loneliness, pet owners were 36% less likely than non-pet owners to report feeling lonely. Having a pet on your side is just as good as having another person on our side that are there to comfort and listen to us when feeling alienated. To further validate how pets help reduce loneliness, the following table shown in Stanley's study depicts depicts the probability ratios of reports on loneliness between pet owners and non-pet owners. According to the results, we see that people who do not own a pet have a higher probability of feeling lonely than pet owners. As a result, by keeping us company during tough times, Having a pet is a great idea to have around since they always be there for us no matter what the circumstances. Another way our pets benefit us is how they are good mood enhancers when we feel anxious or depressed. According to Lifespan.org's review of the Human Animal Bond Research Institute's research about stress and anxiety, it states that 74% of pet owners report improved mental health. Men report less stress, increased social interactions, less depression, and reduced anxiety. Overall, these creatures can help improve our happiness which impacts overall wellness. To be honest, I never knew how much our animal friends do for us. This shows how much we depend on them, just as they depend on us. With those benefits that 
pets provide in our lives? There are some people that do not think that a pet is a benefit to our lives because of the cost attached to them. According to Pet Helpful's article, Eight Reasons to Not Have a Pet, they claim that no matter what type of animal you own, they all have an abundance of inherited costs associated with them. This can include veterinary bills, food, habitats such as cages and tanks, supplies, grooming costs, obedience training, and even boarding when the owner must go away. Make no mistake, owning a pet will cost, will come at a cost. Many financial obligations and sacrifices. I see where they come from, and yeah, there are costs for maintaining a pet, but most of those extra costs listed are optional. The only ones that are mostly important, the only things we will need to buy more often is food. According to this chart, we see different brands and their price per bag. For this data, according to Dog Food Project, a large bag of a store brand dry dog food for a medium sized dog will probably be on the lower side of around $160 per year. This information shows that the cost is for a dog now for any other kind of animal is different but not too expensive if you think about it. In conclusion, I think pets, a pet is the benefit to our lives because of how they help us deal with loneliness and depression as well as how in reality they are worth investing money on. If you're a pet owner and you didn't know these benefits your pet provides you, I hope this video helps you appreciate your pet even more, even if you're not a pet owner. I hope this helps understand that pets are more than an extra financial weight, but a friend who will be there for you and never leave your side free of cost. Whether it is a dog, a cat, a bird, etc. Each animal has its special way to show their appreciation towards us that they just don't receive but give back in many ways the love and care we give them. Thank you so much for your attention and have a great day.